Stick around at the end of this video to test your knowledge with a quiz. Volcanoes. More than just mountains, they are powerful forces of nature. These geological giants have been shaping our world for millions of years. But what is a volcano, you might wonder? Imagine an opening on Earth's surface like a giant vent. Through this vent, Gases, ash, and hot molten rock, known as magma, can escape from deep inside the Earth. When magma reaches the surface, it's called lava. Volcanoes are not just fascinating natural features, they're crucial to understanding our planet's history and future. So let's dive into the explosive world of volcanoes and discover their secrets. Volcanoes come in different shapes and sizes, each with its own unique characteristics. There are mainly three types, shield, cindercone, and composite, or stratovolcanoes. Shield volcanoes, with their gently sloping sides, resemble a warrior's shield lying on the ground. These giants are formed by lava flows of low viscosity. That means the lava is runny, spreading over large areas. Then there are cindercone volcanoes. They're smaller and steeper, built from particles and blobs of congealed lava ejected from a single vent. Last but not least, we have the composite volcanoes, also known as stratovolcanoes. These are the classic, picturesque volcanoes with steep symmetrical cones. They're built from layers of hardened lava, volcanic ash, and rocks ejected during eruptions. Each type of volcano has its own way of telling a story about the Earth's interior processes. As we peek inside a volcano, we encounter an intricate design, much like the layers of an onion. Right at the base is the magma chamber, a vast hidden reservoir of molten rock. From this chamber, magma ascends through the main vent, a pathway carved through the Earth's crust. Now look at the surface of the volcano, where the main vent emerges, and you'll find the crater, a scar from past eruptions. Sometimes magma finds another route through secondary vents, creating multiple outlets for an eruption. And all around, draped over the slopes, are layers of cooled lava and ash, evidence of the volcano's life cycle, each layer a page in Earth's fiery history. When a volcano erupts, it's a display of Earth's incredible power. It may look calm on the outside, but pressure builds up until finally the Earth can contain it no longer. Magma surges through the main vent, and with a monumental force it bursts through the crater, now as lava. This lava can flow like a fiery river or explode into the sky, depending on its thickness. Eruptions can also spew ash clouds high into the air, spreading for miles and affecting the climate. These dynamic outbursts are categorized by their nature. Some are explosive, sending materials high into the sky, while others are gentle, where lava pours out smoothly. Each eruption is unique, painting a picture of nature's raw power and the delicate balance beneath our feet. Volcanoes have left their powerful signature on both the landscape and history. Take Mount Vesuvius, for example, famous for the 79 AD eruption that entombed the city of Pompeii in ash. Then there's Mount St. Helens, which in 1980 reminded us of nature's force with the largest volcanic event in modern US history. Across the oceans, Mauna Loa, Earth's biggest volcano, stretches up from the seafloor with its wide and gentle slopes. And let's not forget the volcano in Iceland with a name that's a tongue twister, 
Age of Fiala Yoko. In 2010, it erupted and sent so much ash into the sky that it stopped airplanes all across Europe. Each of these volcanoes, from the easily pronounced to the less so, from the calm to the explosive, tells a part of our planet's ongoing story. Volcanoes don't just put on a dramatic show, they also play a significant role in shaping the environment. When they erupt, they can change landscapes and even the climate. The ash and gases released into the atmosphere can cool the Earth by blocking sunlight. But volcanoes are also creative forces. They build new lands, islands can grow from the ocean, and mountains rise where there were none. For instance, the Hawaiian Islands owe their existence to the very same volcanic activity that once flowed beneath the ocean's surface. It's a process that may seem destructive, but it's also about creation and transformation, adding new chapters to the story of our living Earth. Living near volcanoes means respecting their power and being prepared. Volcanologists, scientists who study volcanoes, help keep us safe by watching for signs of eruptions. They use tools to measure earthquakes, changes in the shape of the volcano, and even gases coming out of the vent to predict when an eruption might happen. It's important to follow safety guidelines, like evacuation orders, and know what to do if ash falls. Staying informed and ready can make all the difference. After all, Understanding volcanoes isn't just about marvelling at their might, it's also about learning how to live alongside them safely. We've journeyed through the fiery heart of volcanoes, from their explosive eruptions to their silent, creative might. These natural wonders are more than spectacles of ash and lava. They are Earth's way of telling its story, a story of destruction, creation and change. Remember, the power of volcanoes is a reminder of the dynamic world we inhabit, a world to respect, explore, and always keep learning more about. Now, time for that quiz. Don't forget to subscribe!